In this problem, we're looking to write the equation of a sphere that is centered at 5, 4, 9 on a 3D coordinate set. Now, uh, we're meant to make the sphere as large as possible just as long as it does not uh, exit the first octant, which is basically where all three of the coordinates here are positive. So if we're looking to write uh, the equation of a sphere, then let's uh, recall what the general equation for a sphere is meant to look like. And in its most general form, the equation of a sphere is written like this. It's x minus h squared plus y minus k squared plus z minus l squared equals the radius of the circle squared, where r is the radius of the sphere, and h, k, and l are all constants that represent uh, the starting position, or the, the position of the center of the sphere. Now, for that reason alone, the problem itself already did most of the work for us, since it gives us the, the, the position where the center of the sphere is. So let's just fill that out now. So the, for x, it starts at 5, so that's x minus 5 squared, plus y minus 4 squared, plus z, minus 9 squared. And this is equal to the radius squared. Now, the only step they were missing is now we have to figure out what the radius should be. And keep in mind, we're trying to maximize the sphere, but keep it within the octant. So let's take another look at our central point here and figure out, uh, see what we can learn from that, assuming that the, the position of the center is constant. Now notice, that of these three coordinates, the smallest one, or rather the one closest to any of the any of the, the axes planes, is four. That is the smallest one, and that is the closest to the xz plane specifically. So uh, the y position here, or that cannot get any more than four units closer to the xz plane, which will happen if we make it bigger, or else the sphere will start to leave the first octant. We don't want that. So assuming that the center point isn't going to change at all, and then we cannot have the radius of the sphere get any bigger than four units. So if we want to maximize the size, then we'll say that the radius of our sphere will be four. And remember, we write the radius squared on the right side of the formula here. So we'll write this as four squared, or more simply, 16. And this is a pretty simple problem, so this is already the formula we were asked to find. That is the equation for the maximized sphere within the octant.